Hi there, Chris here. Um, this is just a short video to answer some questions that Funky Monkey had and Gary had and um, a couple others, I think. So we had picked this Lockwood uh, with the Leashy KW1. And the question, um, because the, the Lockwood goes from zero to nine, um, key depth, uh, key pin depth, and the Leashy, um, this particular model is for a quick set, and quick set only goes from six, one to six. So what happens if you have a seventh pin in there, or larger? And my first answer was, um, I don't think the Leashy could get under it, um, but I wanted to test that out and show a video. So it doesn't work like that. The reason I don't have the core in there is, is because if we got this old leashy stuck in there, if it were in the core, boy, you're screwed. Something's gonna get wrecked. But with the core out, um, I could pop this cap and relieve the spring pressure and, and so it wouldn't be stuck anymore. So what I've done, um, come on, get in there. There we go. What I've done is I've just, it's only pinned up with two, the first two pins, and they're number seven pins. So you work the leashy in here, he said. Okay, so we're in, and um, one is springy, Two is springy. And when you get a, a springy reading on this leashy, it means generally something's overset. You're, you're, not, <laughs> you're not being able to, um, you know, move the core to set, a, set the spools in this, this Lockwood. But the simple act of having seven, number seven pins in there um, the simple act of pushing this leashy in, this portion of the leashy, <laughs> just sets those seven pins perfectly. So what, what I'm doing by pushing it in is actually setting those pins, and we're already open. So if you had seven pins in, number seven pins in here, you would, that's a gimme. So you could have like three seven pins in there and then you'd only have to pick three real pins as long as they're um, shorter than seven. If you put an eight in there, um, you get an overset. It just automatically oversets it and then you can't set anything else. So that's how that works. So with with seven pins, you get a gimme because... This, not the picking pivot, but this shaft picks the lock. That it sets that at the prop, the seven pin at the proper shear line. Anything larger, as you the act of putting it in, this oversets the pin, and you're out of the game. So that answers that. Hopefully, also new arrivals. This really cool American. Lockwood that I just got that's pinned up to six. Very cool lock. And then um, this, I don't know if I've shown these before. I have a couple of these. These are also American Lockwoods. And I just picked that. I haven't picked it on camera. But I probably won't pick it on camera because I can't gut it easily. I, could, I can gut it. But you have to pound out this little pin, screw this off, Pound out this little pin that's through this shaft, uh, and then you could then you could gut it. So probably too much work to gut, but that's another cool American uh, um, American Lockwood. So I hope that answers the questions. Um, I think that's it. Anyway, thanks for watching. Leave a comment, hit the like, um, say we like Leashy, we hate Leashy. Um, why are you sticking a quick set in a leashy? <laughs> Whatever you want to comment, I will answer your comments. Thanks. See you next time.